Hey guys! Um, so today I'm not actually filming on my camera, I'm filming on my iPhone because I've found that it, because my camera doesn't have a flip screen, it's actually really really tricky for me to try and actually see what's going on so that I can get everything angled right for you guys. So yeah, here we are. So if it's a little bit of a kind of lower quality image, that's why and I'm really sorry about it, but I figured I was going to give this a go just to see if it actually made any difference and made things easier for you. So yeah, I'm really sorry about everything moving, I'm like a bit jittery, but yeah, let's hope this goes well. So today's video is just a really quick little thing about the uh, Lush shampoo and conditioner that I've been using because I, re I really really like the Lush uh, solid shampoos and conditioners. I like the fact that they're a bit more natural and that you don't have to rely on bottles that you can't recycle so it's pretty much waste free. All they come in is a little uh, wax piece of paper which I just use to put them on to stop them from sticking to like my bath or like toilet system top that I put them on. Um, so yeah, I, uh, I've i been using this shampoo which is uh, Jason and the Argan Oil uh, because I basically went in and told the um, assistant at Lush that I really really wanted to use something new of theirs that I hadn't tried before because I'd started to dye my hair and I really wanted something that kind of like nourished it a bit more whereas my hair used to be quite oily and now it's a lot drier so she recommended this because it's got argan oil in so it's quite good at nourishing your hair and keeping it kind of soft and shiny and smooth and so pairing with that I picked up the jungle conditioner which I've used quite a lot of so usually you can see that it says jungle across it um, but this smells so good, I love the smell of this one, and it's basically for hair that gets quite tangly quite easy, um, which mine does, and is quite, like, hair that's quite thick and unruly. So, yeah, this kind of, like, just calms down my hair a bit. I know a lot of people have found using solid conditioners quite tricky, because, um, it, it's, it's very, obviously very different to using normal conditioners, um, and basically what you have to do is just kind of like rub it all over your head and kind of focus on rubbing it into the ends and then I usually leave it in whilst I use my shower gel and shave um, and then wash it out at the end. So I would say it's not as nourishing as my, I usually use a VO5 Revive Me Daily conditioner and that actually makes my hair um, conditioner wise a lot more hydrated. Um, so you can see that kind of I've I've been stripping it at the ends, which is why it's like this. But it's obviously not incredibly nourished. But having said that, I haven't used any products other than these two in my hair at the moment, and I just let it dry naturally. So if I had have gone and dry, hair dried it, I would have used my John Frieda Frizzy Serum, which works really well with these guys to kind of protect your hair from the heat and make sure that it's properly nourished. Um, so yeah, that's really what I wanted to say about these two. I kind of, I love them. I love the kind of no waste impact of them and the fact that obviously they're vegan and cruelty free because they come from Lush. So I hope you enjoyed this video and it wasn't too kind of like moving everywhere for you. Uh, let me know what you think in the comments and as always just like if you like it and subscribe. Thank you.